Hey, what's going on? Got a great question today from Andy Lewis. And he says, hello, John, where and what strength of band would you recommend for the band exercises? Also, what dumbbell weight for those exercises too? My son is almost 15, going to be a freshman, has great mechanics, but tops out at 70 miles per hour. Thank you in advance. Well, uh, that's a great question, Andy. Uh, thank you for that. If you guys have any questions about baseball pitching, whatever it is, drop it down in the comments below. I'd love to help answer those questions for you. To answer your question, Andy, and maybe some of you have the same question, um, what I use is J-Bands. Um, and I sell these on my website. I'll leave a link down below. But there's two different uh, strengths, okay? The color doesn't mean anything for J-Bands. It's all aesthetic. Um, but I got the Yugo Pro Green. Um, they got tons of different colors there that you can choose from so you can get it to match your team color. But uh, I personally use the junior strength. So there's uh, adult uh, J bands and junior J bands. And for me as a grown man, as a professional uh, baseball, former professional pitcher, I would use the junior bands. From I just like that strength. So I definitely recommend the junior bands. Some guys like the, the stronger bands. They don't have to step as far back. For me, I used to like these because some of the exercises uh, you know, are tougher. So you, you want a little less resistance, but the ones you need extra resistance on, you can just scoot back a little further on the junior bands uh, and use those. So that this is just my personal preference. Again, if you like the, the adult bands um, the strength, use those. Um, but me personally, I like these. Uh, I love them so much because they are attached dead center in the middle. Uh, and you can just hook this onto the fence wherever you're trying to, uh, to you know, whatever height you need them at. Um, and then these strap right around your wrist. And I like the ones that go around the wrist and you don't use a handle because the ones using a handle, you really gotta, uh, you know, you're using a lot of forearm um, to stabilize those and grip those, right? But when you have them wrapped around your wrist, you're really focusing the energy where you're trying to put it, which is, uh, you know, more on your arm, your shoulder and your back, where this is where we're trying to get the exercise. I don't wanna be gripping the handle so much that my forearms are burning out and I'm not really getting the correct use out of the exercise, right? So that makes sense. Um, the second part of your question was what size or what weight dumbbells do you use? And uh, I use three pound dumbbells. Uh, again, I know that's light for, you know, some I'm, I was playing when I was playing, for prep, excuse me, when I was playing professional baseball, uh, I was, you know, probably 230 to 240 pounds. So I was a big guy and I was only using three pound dumbbells, okay? We used to do exercises uh, that we call arm flush after pitching. We, you could use them uh, as a warm up before pitching. Um, really, you could use it a couple times a week. Um, and it's just a great way to keep your shoulder strong, um, stable, and uh, free from injury. So I really like the bands, uh, the junior bands, uh, Jaeger bands. I'll leave them down below. These I got off of uh, Amazon, um, and you can get them pretty much anywhere. I got a bunch of different versions of this. Um, so they're not, you know, there's no, I'm not uh, partial to any different kind of, uh, um, you know, brand or anything as far as the, the dumbbells are. It's just, uh, you know, three pounds is good enough to go through the exercise and get out what you need from it. The most important thing is that you, uh, you're you doing it slow, under control, and uh, you're getting your, your arm and your shoulders in shape. So that's the main thing. I hope that, uh, I hope that makes sense, and uh, I hope uh, I hope I answered your question. Sorry for the interruption. We got a little bit of uh, a little bit of company here, buddy. What are you doing? Say hi. Hi. Say hi to the camera. Look at the camera. Say hi. Hi. Say bye. Bye. Say subscribe. That's too big of a word for you. Too many syllables. Until next time. Thank you guys. Leave your comment down below.